Oh god damn it, take the photo right. Are you is this a video? Yes. Oh god damn it. <laughs> How's it going back there? It's going okay. It's, uh, I guess. Guys, let's play yes. the license plate game. Let's collect all the different states. Oh my god, yes, Dad. Um, so whenever you see a new state, we add it to the list. So right up ahead, that's New York right there. Alright, we in BT now. Up the Vermont Country Store. Uh, from Vermont Country Deli. Oh, that's I got excited. Reminds me a lot of upstate New York. Alongside the road. I don't mind it. In Vermont. I'm having a good time rocking outside Very the fun. road. Huh? Good. Yeah. Good. Yeah. Half mile. Yeah. Let's go. Trolls. Oh god, that was so zoomed in. Oh no. Redbridge Productions and Fitted Films. All right, that was fun for me because I'm really into like wildlife and stuff. But the one question I always have when I'm watching that is how close are you actually to the wildlife? I mean, he explained it's like a, a thousand, uh, hundred yards. Is that what it is? Is that the, that the general rule in this type of filmmaking? Well, the, the rule is for everyone there, not just for filmmakers. Uh, so anyone at the park, I think it's 100 yards for bears and then 25 yards actually for everything else, which 25 yards from a bison is, is pretty close. Yeah, it's not that far. It's not that far. Like truffle oil. Well, in, in pasta sauce, sometimes they put beef in it. Oh. Like, what is beef sauce? Beef sauce. Beef sauce. <laughs> Yeah. No, no, that's the problem. Well, not that but also. Hello. Hello. We've been exiled to our own table. <laughs> Meanies. Meanies. Mean. King of the mean. Mean. Food came. Max is too. He doesn't want me to film him, but I'm gonna do it anyway. <laughs> What? The dog? Strolling along. And then. And then that. And then that. Tears. I think that um, often as a nation, when there's a school shooting or a mass shooting, our focus tends to be on who did it, tends to be on the shooter. And I wanted to shift that focus. I wanted to explore the lives of the people who were left behind and how that single fracture of time, as uh, Paul Zarzyski, uh, the poet, writes, can both freeze and incinerate so much. Everyone's made up of a bunch of different parts and make it really literal to see. We just tried to think of things that would be funny. I'm excited for sanitary. <laughs> We in the um, tent, y'all. Let's read it. Yeah. Sanitarium is an original series that consists. What are you doing? What are you doing? So James, <laughs> how was your first time in Vermont going? Uh, was it just me or did that theater look like somewhere that that uh, a group would be performing satanic rituals? 
Yeah. Maybe summoning the devil, but anyone else think that? No, you're just a weirdo. is fuchsia and nine is rose stiletto so I'm gonna zoom you in and we're gonna take a close-up look oh my god yes, yes, yes. oh oh box falling over <laughs> 